You know that the Bible says it's best to not have kids? There are Christian sects from Catholic to Quiverful that believe the opposite and pump out the product like they're on a mission from God, which they think they are. I once heard a pastor say the best way to get more souls into the kingdom of heaven isn't converting people, it's making them. But listen to this delightful piece of existential dread from Ecclesiastes. I declared that the dead who had already died are happier than the living who are still alive. Relatable. But better than both is the one who has never existed. That's the Bible that says that. Of the three states of being that are available to potential humans, God apparently thinks that their current state is the ideal one. Non-existence. It's only going to take two holy seconds for someone to come along and say I'm taking this out of context. But you know what? It's pretty clear. Assuming you're supposed to take the Bible literally. It's completely cool, obviously, to disagree with Ecclesiastes, just like you can disagree with the rest of the arbitrary writings that amalgamated into the Bible. But if you're going to say that it's God's literal words, well, they just told you it's stupid to have babies.